everyone, it's Molly. Hope you're doing well. This piece is an abstract mixed media piece. I started by just brushing on black and gray acrylic paint straight out of the tube. And then I added some golden fluid acrylics to it in white. And that created some of those kind of puffier white parts that you see. I'm now going back in with some tube acrylic metallic paint in gold and bronze and I'm shading those areas so that I can get a little bit more depth and feel to the painting. I really just let myself go with this one. I really just wanted to be creative and just paint something on a canvas. I had no idea what this was going to turn into and it took me quite a few months. I came back to this piece multiple times to add different parts to it. And you'll see as the final result, it's definitely even changed since this video. I am using the paints and leaving them thick in some places so that I could create some texture as well. I'm just kind of scrubbing the brush along to leave some peaks and valleys in the paint to create that extra texture. Abstract art has to be one of the most fun techniques. I love fluid art and acrylic pouring, and when I can combine those things together with regular brush abstract art, it's always amazing. What you're seeing me drip on here now is alcohol ink. I'm using a metallic gold alcohol ink, and I'm just coming in with a little tool to spread it around. The alcohol ink will dry and the sheen that it has is absolutely amazing. It really looks like there's metal on the canvas. So I'm dripping one of my favorite colors and that is an brass color from the alcohol inks. I use um, Pinata brand for my metallics. As I was doing this piece, there were some parts that I liked and some parts that maybe I didn't like quite so much. And so after the alcohol ink dried, I came back in again with my brush and added some more details to it. And that's the great thing about this. You can keep adding and keep adding layers. Now I'm adding on some more of the fluid acrylics and spraying a little bit of water over them so they start to grow and spread out and they give this very, very soft feel. In contrast to that, I'm now coming back in and layering in some more black layers so that I could have some hard lines. I think this last little bit is really what made the painting. When I'm thinking about composition or thinking about how a piece should look, I really think about what's pleasing to the eye, what draws the eye across the canvas, and I really try to make those things play off of each other. Going back in and adding all these black parts to it really gave an almost dimension to the painting that it didn't have before. It felt almost flat before I added these pieces in. I added the crushed glass and secured it with resin at the end, and I really like how this piece came out. There is so much to look at, 
so many things going on, and I dyed the crushed glass with the alcohol inks. Well, I hope you like this painting. Thank you so much for watching. Happy painting.